As promised by Prime Minister Kamla Prasad Bisasa following her tour of Diego Martin on Monday, CPEP workers were busy on Wednesday clearing mud and debris in the hope that they can help prevent a repeat of Monday's massive flooding. More rains are forecast. It's that which causes a scare to residents like Sheldon Chunu, whose home was covered by up to five feet of mud and debris. He estimates his losses to be over $200,000. As you can see by the house right there, it's up to the window height was rubble. And my neighbors and them, thank God for neighbors, they help tremendously in supporting me by saving most of the things over there. If you look up this incline, you would see the removal of natural vegetation. And the size of this boulder gives you an indication of what took place here on Monday. Boulders of these size came cascading down this incline, removing everything in its path. It is these boulders which terrified residents, some of which ended up in their homes. Kenneth Thompson, CPEP Regional Program Coordinator, says they are working with engineers from the Ministry of Works to help avert any further disaster. I would expect that if, if remedial works is not speedily done, we can experience such an outburst once more. But we are hoping that we will be able to complete the exercise we have decided to undertake and have been mandated to undertake and that we would not have the type of um, the magnitude of this uh, catastrophe occurring with this family. Thompson is appealing to citizens to immediately stop the indiscriminate dumping of garbage and water courses saying this could lead to further flooding. For CNC3, I'm Roshan Sukram.